Hey everybody, I am Kevin Ioli. On Saturday at T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada is UFC 245. Not one, not two, but three world championship fights. It is an absolutely stacked card. I cannot wait. I wanna give you my predictions uh, for the three title fights on the card. In the first of the three title fights, it's going to be the women's Bantamweight champion, Amanda Nunes. She is going to defend her title against Jermaine Durandamy. You may remember that Jermaine Durandamy won the UFC Women's Featherweight Championship uh, about a year ago, uh, was stripped of that after she had a hand injury. Uh, Jermaine is a terrific striker. She actually fought Amanda once before. They fought at Fight for the Troops in Kentucky in 2013, and it was really not much of a fight. Amanda took her down early in the fight, dropped some elbows on her, Herb Dean stopped it, three minutes and 50 seconds, and Amanda Nunes won that. I think that's gonna be how it goes again, except this time, I think you're gonna see more of the complete game from Amanda. So I'm gonna predict Amanda Nunes by third round finish. Whether she knocks her down and finishes her with maybe a rear naked choke, or she just absolutely knocks her out, I look for Nunes to retain the title. In the co-main event, it's going to be Max Blessed Holloway defending his featherweight championship against Alex Volkanovski. And this is really a tough fight for Max because Volkanovski is a huge guy, a former rugby player who weighed 220 pounds when he was playing rugby, now trimmed down as an MMA fighter to 145. And he has a complete overall game. But there are a few better than Max Holloway. I think Holloway's combination of strikes, kicks, and his ground game is second to none. There aren't many better than him in all of MMA. I look for Max Holloway to win a decision. And in the main event, this is the grudge match to end all grudge matches. The welterweight champion of the world, Kamaru Usman, is gonna defend his belt, his first title defense against his former teammate, Colby Covington. And Colby Covington, who is, uh, I would say he plays a MAGA character, uh, President Trump's biggest fan. Uh, he was at the press conference that announced this fight. He was reading Donald Trump Jr.'s book. Uh, Colby Covington has just made a name for himself as the biggest heel in MMA. And whatever he can say to irritate people, he will say it. Uh, he certainly has gotten under Kamaru Usman's skin. They almost got into a brawl at a buffet the day after Usman beat Tyron Woodley to win the championship. I think this is going to be a heck of a fight. It's a fight that either guy can win. But if I had a pick, I am going with Colby Covington to score the upset. I think his cardio and his wrestling are going to be the difference in this fight. Look for Colby Covington to win a decision in a really good fight. Those are my picks for UFC 245. Put your Com your answers down in the comments, who you'd like to win these fights, and stay tuned to Yahoo Sports for coverage all week.